Hi guys, it's Inam Kafour here with the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 and we're going to take a look at the easy clip functionality on the Note 2 see how well it works. So first of all, for easy clip you're going to need the S Pen itself. Now what easy clip is effectively is a screenshot tool where you can take freehand screenshots of certain parts of the screen, not necessarily all of the screen. All you need to do is hold down the S Pen button then do whatever shape you're looking for on the screen and then whatever's there it will do it. So I'm going to do a weird splash as you can see there it generates it says X or save and it'll automatically save it anyway or you can hit the scrapbook and you can see it says copy to clipboard now if you want to see where it puts it all you do is go to your applications gallery I'll say the gallery rather and then there will be a subfolder there called screenshots and as you can see I've got a bunch of screenshots already in there but if I go to the top one that's the weird shape I've just done and I can paste that into an email, put it in a text message and do all kinds of stuff with it from there. You can also do in-game footage as well. So if I just load up a game here, Need for Speed Most Wanted. As that loads, at various points I'm going to take screenshots using the S Pen. Not full screen ones, just specific parts of the screen. So if I want to do another one there. That should have done it as well. You can see there it goes and it will save it to the clipboard if I don't do anything either there you go so if I do want another one as I say this takes a, a capture of whatever shape you're drawing no matter what application is on the screen we'll just load up a game so load up one of the races here and Let's see what options it gives me. That will do the Camaro. Just get that going so it's actual in game footage. Wait till that loads. So here we go, game's underway. As you can see, I'm going to use the S Pen and just take a really wishy washy look at it. And it's capturing a screenshot in a weird splash shape that I did as you can see there it'll save it automatically to the scrapbook and the screenshot section and return me back to the game so if I do resume again get the car going again straight there you go we'll do another one this time we'll do a triangle and then you can see the little timer going there it's got the screenshot and it'll save it to the clipboard automatically copied I'm gonna just exit out of this game Okay, come out and need for speed most wanted. Now you can also go to websites and copy information from there. So if I go to BBC News I've got here, if I want I can do just a screenshot from there if I want. Again, another triangle one. Whatever's on the screen it'll do and it'll save it to the clipboard. But if I want to do text as well, you can do a single line across text with the, the button again pressed and it will copy it just in terms of pure text not a screenshot text copied so if I want to copy BBC that particular line there so again hold it down the S Pen button just going across it and you can see the crosshairs are there highlighting the text I can hit copy from the copy button there it says copy to clipboard and then I can come out of that application now I can paste it whatever I want email text messaging whatever so just to show you, I'm going to go into my text messaging application here. I'm going to hit the cog button, get to the submenu here. I'm going to tap the clipboard option and you can see I've got the text there which says BBC the government which is what we just copied and it's not a screenshot, it's an actual copying of the text and if from here if I wanted to add uh, another screenshot of what we did in the game I can put that in as well. You can see it adds it in and you can add it into an email, put it into a memo and here put it into a text message as well unfortunately you can't copy text from Facebook or stuff like that but you can do screenshots of it so if I go into Facebook here and if I try and do a single line copy of any text pretty much which is on here um, and what we'll do if I do that like we've just did on the internet it doesn't work it doesn't allow you to use this functionality on social networking apps but if I want to take a screenshot using the easy clip functionality just hold down the button 
and then it simply copies it as it does there, saves it to the clipboard and you're ready to go. If you want to individually see what's already copied, all you do is, again, go to your gallery. I'll just load that up. Go to your screenshots subfolder and you can see this is what we've just copied from Facebook. That's what we copied from the BBC website. That's what we copied from the in-game footage from Need for Speed Most Wanted. Again, another in-game footage one that we did with a wishy-washy shape. There's a circular one that we did as well. Again, that was from when the game was loading. It works brilliantly. The easy clip functionality allows you to take full screen screenshots as well if you wanted to, just by double tapping on the screen. But individual shapes as well work brilliantly and you can paste them into virtually any application. Social networking apps don't work quite the same in the sense of you can't copy text from them, but you can take screenshots because whatever's on the screen, you can take a screenshot of it, either full screen or via the Easy Clip freehand screenshot there and it puts it straight into your screenshots folder. Another brilliant feature on the Galaxy Note 2 using the S Pen. Any questions or comments you guys have got, hit them up down in the comment section down below there. Give us a thumbs up if you like this video and you like what you saw. If you haven't already done so, hit subscribe from the button down there. It doesn't cost you anything and it's totally free and you can check out some of our forthcoming videos. Thanks for watching, have a wicked day and we'll see you next time.